Tinefra, and Scare Screams. Today we're going to be teaching you how to make. Now, how to make these delicious treats is you take a bag of marshmallows and find green sprinkles. Of course, because it's all about green. Don't want the leprechauns to get you. And then you have the stove back here to melt the marshmallows, but we'll be doing that later. And kids, you will need adult supervision to use the oven. And if this seems too complicated, use a microwave. Here we have these Jet Puff marshmallows that we are going to be using. And um, I guess we'll be melting those now. So the first thing you're going to be doing is taking, um, well, about 10 marshmallows, setting them on a plate, and putting them in the microwave. Make sure the plate's not metal. That could be bad. Now, let it melt. And then later, um, make sure to wash your hands and then shape the marshmallows into a cubic form. Put these in the microwave for about how long enough you feel comfortable with and how long you think they would melt for. Or, you know, there still is the stove option. Scara is already getting ready the marshmallow treats. Now, um, it's Scara Screams back here, and, um... Instead of shaping it cubic likewise, I thought I would do more of a St. Patrick's Day way and shape it like a four-leaf clover. But your marshmallows won't be very sticky for the sprinkles to go on, so run the marshmallows under some water and they will get sticky. Taking your green sprinkles, you are going to be taking them and putting them on the marshmallows. Now, this is a different kind of sprinkle. So, it's like glitter sprinkles. And yes, this can get very messy. So, always keep a paper towel by you. So, here is the first one. If you are at a party serving these, then perhaps you want to make more. So this will be your finished product. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned to see more fantastic, delicious recipes. And goodbye. Keep watching the Scara and Nefra cooking show. Bye.